So I suffered really badly with um, panic, panic attacks, depression, anxiety, and I numbed those things with drugs, alcohol, fighting, stuff like that, you know, very destructive things. And um, after my friend committing suicide and then, you know, COVID happening and me just isolating myself to where I got to a really dark place in my head. And um, so I would park my car up on the cliffs, try and get the courage to drive off. So I was up there one night and uh, I was going through Instagram and I was friends with Amy in high school. And then it was like, can I pray for anyone? And that was totally like divine intervention. So then I sent her like all this stuff. And um, after all, she was like, why don't you come to church? So then I was like, okay, I'll go to church so that I can say I tried 100% of all the possibilities so that I can, in my mind, I can really validate, like, you've tried everything, so now you can do it. And then I came here and uh, it was a very life-changing experience. Um, the first time I came to Jesus Center, uh, the sermon was about Jesus being a dealer of hope. And it was very weird because that spoke to me because, you know, drug dealers and stuff like that. and. Uh, Pastor Daniel had said, um, why don't you give hope a try? And um, I was like, that's a drug that I've never tried, you know? Like, that's a drug that I, I haven't had access to or I never, you know, saw. I had access to everything else, but not hope, you know? And then I came here and um, I remember Russ prayed over me and that was really insane. It was just like, that was like a natural, like, hope drug, you know? because um, I came out of here like really wonky and just like, ah, you know, but uh, yeah. Um, so since developing a relationship with God, I've um, actually got hope for the future that I never had. Um, I'm able to be sober. I'm able to be present for the people that I love and um, just not live such a dark, hate-fueled lifestyle. This is your friend, Andrew Stack. And if you need hope, come to Jesus Center because Jesus deals hope. Take a hit of hope and that's it.